Hey, we are back. Hello. We're finally going to Cape Caleb or whatever it's called. Also, we're I'm, already there. I'm level 54. Crap, I forgot to do a thing. Uh, Brilliant. You only I know. have 30. Oh, did I already? I already did what I needed, I think. No, this. There we go. Oh. Uh-huh. Yeah, we're going to ride a boat. Yeah. Ferry. It's, of... it's our dad's boat. <laughs> oh. I have cool. a uh, gemstone. Right. I'll give you a call when it's ready. Oh, well, that's awkward. Whatever. All right. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Let's go. Set sail for Altitia. No more open world. As far as we know. Puppy! It's so fluffy. And smart. And a, basically a GPS. Where are they getting the stickers from? <laughs> Just be like, got it. <laughs> what did she say? Uh, see you at Al uh, I'll be waiting for you at Altitia. Oh. So I might actually be able to see her. Yay. Like in person. Also, we watched that movie, Kingslave. Yeah. Yeah, the prequel. Well, it's sort of, it's more like a, fills in some details of a scene. Yeah. Uh, it's pretty interesting. Yeah. I would give it a watch. If you want to, like, know the whole story of this game. Yeah. And I guess there's and also like, Brotherhood, but I don't yeah, know. Yeah, but I don't know what that is. Yeah. Yeah, I, I would watch that movie if you want to understand what happened in Insomnia after Noct left. Yeah. Like. And how the hell yeah. Luna Freya ended up with the ring. It explains that. Yeah. Even Marshall came to say goodbye. Core. Oh, the Marshall. Oh, I guess I should I talk to you guys. Yes! <laughs> I was wondering that before we started. I guess it's goodbye for now. Don't cry. <laughs> Don't cry. Please. But yay, the marshal. Something I gotta get off my chest. Uh oh. What's that? Uh oh. I'm sorry. Sorry I wasn't there for your father. Oh. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, all the feels. <laughs> you gotta talk to Core. Did Sid already, he already booked? Yeah. That's one fast old man that's crippled. <laughs> Jesus Christ. You never have too many tools. Here, learn to wield not only weapons, but magic as well. Ooh. Ooh. A magic flask. Oh. Oh, I thought it was gonna be something more interesting. All right. But doesn't he look like the dude? Yeah. You know, for an invitation, he does. On board. He looks like a <laughs> he looks like a person from the movie, but he he better fucking not be. Yeah. Hey, your Majesty. What? What's up? Please come back soon. We need our king. <laughs> yeah. Count on it. He dies. Knocked dies. Oh no. <laughs> what if he doesn't though? What if he comes back? I'm just joking. <laughs> <laughs> you 
Yeah, the main character dies. <laughs> I mean, that happens in these games sometimes. Yeah. But I... I uh... 13, it was a little <laughs> weird. Yeah. Like, everyone was happy-go-lucky. And then... And then not. Right. Aww. We're keeping that. Uh, That's cute. You want me to keep it? It's Talcott. Okay. And he's happy. That's despite the fact cute. that his grandpa's dead. Yeah. We need a picture of the picture. Pictureception. <laughs> Ooh, group photo. Oh, wait. Who's that weird guy on the left? <laughs> That's oh, Gentiana's in the back, too. Oh, what? Why aren't they commenting on that? I don't know. It's saving that. Oh, Jesus. Eh. We deleted a bunch earlier. Yeah, we cleared out, and now we're filling back up again. Oh, boy. <laughs> Callings. Do you want to read it? No. <laughs> I mean, I'm reading it, but I'm not reading it out loud. Do you want me to read it out loud? Sure. Noctis receives a warm send-off as he sets sail for Altitia in the high uh, in high spirits. The prince goes forth ostensibly, ostensibly to seek the blessings of the Hy- the gods. Hydrion. Hydrion. Hy- I think yeah. it's Hydrion, which will enable him to challenge the empire's might. But his true heart's desire is to find Luna Freya, his betrothed. We're gonna find the Leviathan. Yes. Who's a giant snake motherfucker. Pretty awesome. I'm nodding. No one can see that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when we first met, I used to do it on the phone all the time. You would be talking and I would just be like nodding. <laughs> Super helpful. Just like, all right. Are you going to respond? Oh, it's crap. fucking that guy. And, and that guy. And that guy who's you still a fucking a mystery. Ride. Oh fuck you. Gone to such to Can we kill that guy yet? Ah, uh, oh, but for an outsider to lose the Imperial Army must be a battle in and of itself. You've spoken to Lady Luna Freya. Yeah, see look, their hair is much more white in the game than it is in the movie. Oh, yeah. That obstinate secretary standing in the way. While you Rush off to slay the Hydrian for your poor sister's sake. I still don't understand that guy. I know the price of the covenant. Ooh, ooh, you know who he looks like? Who? Who does he look like? Hat and clogs from Bleach. <laughs> you know, I've always wanted to go sailing like this. Not oh, I'm You're driving the boat! <laughs> I'm driving the boat. Here it's just us and the horizon. Tip it over. <laughs> Just tip the boat over. So we're going to go find the Hydreon, but then we're going to have to go back because like, I know Ifrit's not over there. Yeah. Yeah. A Leviathan. Oh my god. You're not going. Well, this is as far left as I could go. Oh. <laughs> She's stupid. You think Lady Luna Freya's in danger there? The Empire did invade Lucis for the ring. No faith their ruthless ambitions will stop short of harming the Oracle. Without the ring, the crystal's no more than a rock. Hmm. I suppose. Does anyone know how Lady Luna Freya came to have the ring? We do! Likely, His Majesty entrusted it to her safekeeping back at the Crown City. So she's held on to it this whole time, all the way to Altitia. The ring is important then. So is Leviathan. But Luna comes first. You know, I was thinking back. I wonder if he still can't pronounce her name. <laughs> Do you recall an apparatus in place of his arm? Yeah, I remember. Who? Seems he lost another one in the invasion. 
Uh, her brother. Oh, Luna's brother. Yeah. Okay, so there's a thing that happens with that in the movie. Hey. I just chalked it up to the Oracle lineage. His ancestry may be part of it, but that alone wouldn't account for his freakish strength. Freakish. Freakish. Freak. There's a disturbing rumor about Lord Rapus has taken to brandishing His Majesty's sword. Oh, this motherfucker. So we're going to have to kill him to get your dad's sword. Oh, great. That's okay by me. Oh. For all his newfound powers, he's still the Chosler's lapdog. Holding on to the enemy king's sword like some badge of honor. It might help if we knew what he was after. Would not the Empire will crash the pool party with Leviathan? Oh yeah, because we know what happened to his arm. Yeah. It went up in fucking flames. Yeah. But we won't tell you why, because it would spoil the movie. Yeah. We beat him to the big guy. Thanks to our friendly guide. <laughs> Never know which way that one's gonna move next. Who? Oh, that guy. Yeah. <laughs> he does. Sometimes it helps. Like when he called off his army and let us escape. But he was still a creep about it. <laughs> <laughs> he's only helping us because he wants something. We just don't know what. Yeah, no one does. I don't understand. He's not wearing the same colors as the rest of the Imperial Army. Yeah. He's wearing... Hobo clothes. No, he's wearing the frickin' Lucis colors. Black. And when he does come to our aid, I see only condescension in his eyes. Yeah, can I wear that? Ever think you think too much? Sometimes, but it's always preferable to the alternative. Are we there yet? <laughs> Pardon me. Yeah, but all this ocean gets kind of bland after a while. <laughs> Last time I checked, it was amazing and life changing. <laughs> so soon you'll have your old man's Wait. ring back. Sid's driving the boat. Oh, <laughs> I think he's been here the whole time. <laughs> it was his heritage. Is that what my dad said? Carrying a royal line ain't a task to be taken lightly. For a small thing, that ring is sure way heavy. Damn fucking straight. King, You'd know if you watched the movie. Saw his face in the paper. Wait, weren't you at the coronation? No, I was long gone from the city. You must have been invited at least. Had a fallen out of sorts with your old man. Oh. Right at the end of the trip. You did? I was given to understand you stayed in touch. We buried the hatchet years later. But never talk face to face again. Poor Sid. Uh, paid a visit while I had the chance. Well, no use dwelling on it now. Oh. <laughs> hole, but y'all gonna stay in Alticia for a good while, right? Yes. We believe so. In that case, I'll tune her up for y'all. Ah. Oh. Don't have much to do though. <laughs> what with Cindy looking after the old girl. If you say she's good, she must be great. She was never afraid of hard work. Heaven knows she had a hard childhood. Hard childhood? Well, she doesn't have freaking parents. Lost them both when she was little. She was big enough to understand, but... And to hurt. Oh. But you won't guess that, seeing her now. Not at all. She's always so cheerful. Well, that ought to tell you how far she's come. Well, you must have seen your fair share of Altisha by now. Yeah, cuz you really need it for a fucking speedboat. <laughs> Hey now, Wescombe, 
hang with Reggie and me way back when. Hmm. Oh, was he the other one in that photo with the garage? Yeah, runs himself a diner or a cafe or something. Reggie? Go and see for yourself. What? Re Re Regis, sure. your dad. Oh. Reggie, Reggie, nickname. Okay, I get it now. <laughs> Moogle! It's a fucking Moogle! I bet you it's the Moogle. Oh my god. Oh, you motherfuckers. Whoa, look at this. This seems dangerous. Yeah. And like a really obvious way to get caught. Yeah, this seems like a choke point. That's probably why it's... Yeah, look at that. Hmm. Danger. Does this vessel have an entry permit? Uh, entry permit? Relax. I got one. <laughs> Here. That's as old as they get. Things in order. Let me pass. <laughs> Alright. I guess. <coughs> Ugh. Luckily, Sid was driving. Yeah. I was wondering where he was, because I couldn't see him. Could say that. 30 odd years ago. That's what the guy meant by old. Lucky us, huh? This could have ended badly. I don't know. We could have just murdered the guy. This is a really pretty, like... Venice esque city. Yeah. Why are we driving on a waterfall? This seems not smart. <laughs> <laughs> Probably to give you a well, I don't know, it's because there it is right there. This is really pretty though. It's huge. Wonder how long I'll be staying at Altitia. I told you it was Venice. <coughs> Listen Excuse to that me. music. There's even fucking gondolas. Is that what they're called? Uh, I don't know. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Gondola. You fucking called it. <laughs> 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 yes, you did. What do you mean? Is there still more? Oh, boy. Yep. Let oh, me guess. Boy. Ignis is prepared this Sir, time. What is the purpose of your visit? Purpose, uh... To punch you all in the face. Uh, Ignis. Ignis, <laughs> Ignis a little help. Oh, utterly hopeless. Oh. We are scholars of the culinary arts, and we've come to study the renowned cuisine of your fair nation. Is that so? I wish you an enlightening stay. Thanks, Ignis. Oh, you owe me. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Sid was with you. I thought he was going to stay with the fucking boat. Well, maybe he's going to help us out a little bit more. Or he's leaving now. You wanna check Weskin's place out? Yeah. Oh, yeah, he's got to show us that. Go to Marco. Perhaps we'll even make it in time for tea. Then you <laughs> Sid's just like... <laughs> <laughs> I'm tired of this shit. Search for Weskin's boat. Oh, it says it's the Mago, not the Moogle. Oh. <laughs> they missed the exhibit for Lady Lunafreya's wedding dress. <gasps> the Vivian Westwood? But wasn't that a memorial for her passing? Well, now it's a memorial for her safe return. Let's go see it while we still <laughs> can. Oh, Capitalism. Could that be the dress we read about in the papers? Doubtless. The designer's name is the same. Want to check it out? That depends on the groom. Might still be a sore spot. Why the wedding can be called off? <laughs> Who says we can't call it back on? It can still happen. True enough. Let's keep an eye out for it. All right. I guess I don't get a choice, but you know. Okay, well we have to go find the Mago. Which I know. Is, they missed a perfectly good opportunity to call it the Moogle. Yeah. Good. Get it together, Square Enix. It's fine. Oh. Maruza Street? Oh, no what I expected. <laughs> <laughs> trash! Trash? There's trash on the floor. Oh. 
you don't need to look at it. It's kind of everywhere. <laughs> what about it? Oh. Is it trash? Oh my god, Gladio. It's all the way over there. <laughs> <laughs> the Leville. Conveniently located near a gondola shop, our, our hotel is the perfect base for exploring Altitia. Blah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, all right. Pardon let's, me. Let's fucking get out of my way. <sighs> that right. is a shiny. You know what? I'm getting lost. We'll figure it out in the next episode. Okay, bye. Bye.